Welcome back to episode 104, part two, pay-per-view review. We do ECW, the year 1997. And as you said a while ago, not one pay-per-view, not two pay-per-views, not three pay-per-views, but four. Four pay-per-views. We're going to start out with ECW, barely legal, April the 13th, 1997. I kind of wish some of these companies would go back to this. And like slow down on pay-per-views. Oh, pay yeah, definitely. The first match is the Eliminators, John Cronus and Perry Saturn, defeating the Deadly Boys, Bubba Ray and Devon, who were the ECW Tag Team Champions, come to the ring by Joel Gertner and Sign Guy Dudley. So, Eliminators are the new Tag Team Champions that lasted 6 minutes, 11 seconds. Up next, in a match that lasted 10 minutes and 10 seconds, 10-10, ten, ten, as are the... D defeated Lance Storm. And I shouldn't have started this thing out because I got the Japanese people. <laughs> Great Susuke Granhamana and Masato Yakashirle. And, uh, I'm good with it. Is I'm, that a number one or an that L? Is a one. That's a number one at the end. Right That's weird. Defeated BWO Japan. Since NWO had a Japan, BWO has a Japan. Takamoku Jungle. As you say something? Taka Mushinoku. Like the Mushinoku driver. That's it. Uh, Terry Boy and our, our <laughs> yearly award. Yes. This man has been, we named our yearly award after <laughs> this man right here, Dick Togo. It was a six man tag team match and it lasted 16 minutes and 55 seconds. That's a long. I think that's six man match. Usually better than, I better be long than four minutes. That's true. Up next is Shane Douglas, your ECW World Television Champion, with Francine, defeated Pitbull number two, two, in 20 minutes and, and 43 one. seconds. 20, he had a 16 minute match, and now a 20, over a 20 minute match, back to back. And then, ladies and gentlemen, the next match was Taz, with Bill Alfonso defeating Sabu, in another long match of 17 minutes, 49 seconds. And another one, coming up next. It's amazing. This one lasted 19 minutes and 10 seconds. It's insane. It is insane. As Terry Funk defeated the Sandman and Stevie Richard with Blue Meanie, Hollywood Nova and Thomas Rodman and 7-Eleven. a lot of people out there. In a three-way dance to turn the number one contender for the ECW World Heavyweight Championship in 1910. And the winner of that, Terry Funk, went immediately. No breaks. No bra No rest. Old 60-year-old man had to go straight into the match. Don't leave the ring. You stay right there. That's right. And he defeated and became the ECW World Heavyweight Champion by beating Raven in a 7-minute, 20-second match. And I do believe that the right after he won the title, there was literally a power outage in the arena. <laughs> Completely can, wiped him out. I can believe it. Up next to that same year, 1997, was Heat Wave, July 19th, 1997. We started with one dark match as Francine defeated Butyl McGillicuddy in six minutes. And then, your first match of the pay-per-view, Mikey Whiprack and Spike Dudley defeated PG-13, J.C. Ice and Wolfie D. And Jason in a handicap match that lasted ten minutes, 
13 seconds. Up next on the car was Axel Rotten defeated Tracy Smothers in 9 minutes and 8 seconds. And then, the fourth match of the evening, John Cronus defeated Pablo Marquez. 11, I don't know who that is. 11 minutes and 34 <laughs> seconds. I've never, this dude, I don't think you look at this on the network. You can definitely try and see if it's on the network. Oh, see, Lord. Pablo Marquez. Pablo Marquez. Up next, the fifth match of the evening was Chris Candino. He was Spanish. I will say that too. Chris Canino and Bam Bam Bigelow defeated Chris Chetty and Balls Mahoney in 13 minutes and 51 seconds. Wow, so three out of four of those people are passed away. Hey. That sucks. <laughs> hey. That, that sucks. Bad. sucks. Yeah. That's like, well, that's like looking at WrestleMania from like yeah. in the beginnings. Dead, you know? dead, dead, dead life? <laughs> yes. One out of 12. Okay. Man. We were a little morbid there for a second. Go ahead. Just a second. Yes. Just a second. All right, the sixth match, Taz defeated Lance Storm, and then the E, that doesn't show who the champion is. I guess he retained his belt. I don't know. Def it wasn't on there. It wasn't on there. The okay. ECW World Television Championship match, 12 minutes, 23 seconds. I'm going to say Taz was, because Lance Storm was. Lance Storm, remember? I think he, he was TV champion. Ooh. I think he was. I think. I was looking it up, because I believe they'll have Heat Wave on the network for only nine. Da -da -da. Up next was... Was the ECW World Heavyweight Championship, and it lasted 15 oh, minutes. Oh, the dot. Oh, the no, I 15, 15 minutes. That's a good timing out. I have to give it to him on that one. As your champion, Terry Funk defeated Shane Douglas by DQ. Yes, where am I? Eight. Gangsters, New Jack, and Mustafa Saeed. This kind of sounds a little scary. It does. I got stabbed on that one. Right? Saeed! <laughs> Defeated <laughs> the Dudley Boys, Bubba Ray and Devon, who again, with the Tag Team Champions, <laughs> losing the belts again. I know. Wow. Two pay per views in a row. That's all they do. That's all they do. And it was a steel cage weapons match, so the asylum match. <laughs> yes, I guess so. Several without the top. Thingy well, at the top, yes. Yes. Uh, so the gangsters are now your new ECW World uh, Tag Team Champions. Seven minutes, 17 minutes, 44 seconds. That's a big one. Not as big as the main event. Ooh. It was a steel cage match. It was a, also a six-man tag team steel cage match. Right. As you had RVD, Sabu, and Jerry the King Lawler. You're thinking, what? Right. RVD? So Jerry Lawler? Weird. They defeated Tommy Dreamer, which is weird. Yep. The Sandman and Rick Rude. That's weird too. By stoppage. Stoppage. In 32 minutes and 24 seconds. Time must get listed up. And Sandman. Rude probably did. No, he probably didn't do much of that. Stop it. And then we have a, whole, a right. Thank you. Then we have uh, unless they gave up. Somebody I'll gave have up. To look, I'll have to look on the network. See if that's something to see. Why they stopped the steel cage match? Right. Where are we at? Go up one. Yes, yeah, thank you. Hardcore Heaven, August seventeenth, nineteen ninety seven. Your ECW World Television Champion was Taz, and he defeated Chris Candido. I actually said it right. I always say that last name wrong, and I don't know why. 10 minutes and 52 seconds. Up next, you had Bam Bam Bigelow defeating Spike Dudley in 5 minutes and 5 seconds. Or I guess from the famous scene where he throws him in the third That's what I was thinking. When I saw Bam Bam Spike, I thought that's the one we close to him. Third row. Whee! <laughs> Little guy in here. Okay. Catch me! <laughs> that's a new definition of crowd surfing right there. Yes. Oh, it's a me now? Full H. It's me now. It is you now. He has three. Third match, RVD with Bill Alfonso defeated Al Snow. So this match will be on oh, sorry. the Sleep A DVD <laughs> Monday Night Wrestling Rules match <laughs> in 13 minutes and 43 seconds. Mr. Monday Night. That's a long time. RVD. Up next, your fourth match of the evening, the Dudley Boys, Bubba Ray and Devon with Jenna oh, Jameson, God Joel Gartner, Sangai Dudley, Big Dick Dudley defeated the Gangsters, New Jack and Mustafa, who are the champions by forfeit. To become the new ECW Tag Team Champions in no time. There was, was no a time. That means they never came out. They never came out. It was a forfeit. But then immediately after that in the fifth match, the Dudley Boys, Bubba Ray and Devon, who are the Tag Team Champions at this point, with Jenna James and Joel Gardner, Zyga Dudley and Big Dick Dudley, <laughs> defeated PG-13, i.e. J.C. Ice, not, <laughs> not Icy. 
JC Ice. <laughs> Icy JC. Well, because I was jumping over the J, I was like, C Ice. I was like, whoa. JC Ice and Wolfie D, they retain their tag team titles against uh, PG 13 in 10 minutes and 58 seconds. Your next match, the sixth match on the card, was Tommy Dreamer with Beulah McGillicuddy defeated Jerry Lawler in 18 minutes and 57 seconds. And then you moved if it was a three way dance for the ECW World Heavyweight Championship. And it lasted 26 minutes and 37 seconds. And Shane Douglas with Francine defeated your ECW uh, World Heavyweight Champion Sabu, who was with Bill Alfonso and Terry Funk, to win the championship. The ECW credit. Their main events are long, like they need to be. They are long? Yes. Except for the first one for seven minutes. But hey. But it was. Leading up to that was. Technically two main events in a row. Yeah. Right? yeah. Your next match and final card of 1997 was November 2, remember, November 30th, 1997. We started off with Chris Candido and Lance Storm defeating Tommy Rogers and Jerry Lynn in 60 minutes and 42 seconds. Tommy Rogers? What in the world? Tommy Rogers? What's that? And Jerry Flynn. Not Jerry Flynn. <laughs> <laughs> Jerry Flynn! Jerry Flynn, he a Mr. Anyway, JL. He was like a kickboxer guy or something. Anyway, the second match was Mikey Whipwreck defeating Just Incredible with Jason. Seven <laughs> minutes and 15 seconds. With who? Jason. Jason. Yes. Well, we Jason. all remember. Hey, Jason. Kind of like Cher, Madonna, you know. Jason. Yes. The third match well, of the evening was the ECW World Television Championship match. It lasted one minute and 29 seconds. Oh, wow. That's not good. As Taz defeated Pitbull number two with Pitbull, Pitbull number Pitbull. one. Pitbull! Brackus and Lance Wright in the corner there. Lance Wright? You have to watch on the network. Brackus was in WWE. I can see him being Brackus in a minute and 29 seconds. But <laughs> <Pitbull number> <laughs> <two>. <laughs> wow. Taz must have ding 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 locked the Taz mission. <laughs> you said, I can see him being Brackus. Hey, look who Jerry's with. Woo! Woo! Oh, look out. I'm getting started. Back or a kick in. That's true, but he'll get real happy. She really likes the old ones now, so she you know. does. And then she you know he Jerry. loves that. Jerry Where are we at now? now? Fourth match. match. FBI, Tracy Smothers and Little Guido, the uh, tag team champions. Oh, you're going to wait out here. It's double minded. Yeah, it's a four way dance. Uh, it's a four way dance for the uh, ECW ta uh, World Tag Team Championships. Lasted 14 minutes and 32 seconds. FBI. Tracy Smothers and Little Guido. With Tommy Roch. Tommy Roch. <laughs> Tommy Roch. <laughs> <laughs> Say like Tommy Rogers and Tommy Rich at the same time. <laughs> she Tommy changed Crunch? her hair again? It's like lighter. That's it. <laughs> Sorry. Ooh, butterfly. Okay. Yeah. Tommy Rich. Yes. Not Roch. <laughs> 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 Defeated to retain their tag team titles to be the Dudley Boys with Big Dick, Sonia, <laughs> and Joe Gertner. Hardcore chair swinging freaks, Balls Mahoney and Axel Rotten. Rest in peace, both of you. <laughs> And the Gangstinators, New Jack and John Kronos. Because it's the Eliminators and the Gangsters put together. Yes, because I think one gangster was gone or hurt and the, other, and, the other, and the other Eliminator was hurt or gone. <laughs> so they put them together. Yes, it happens. It works. That's, that's the mind of Paul Heyman. Your first match of the card, if I don't to remember, was Tommy Dreamer with Bela McGillicuddy fought RVD with Bill's Alfonso. Bill's Al <laughs> Bill's Alfonso? Keep old Tommy Crotch over there. <laughs> <laughs> to a no contest and a flag match. Yes, folks. Oh, a, flag? a flag match. 16 minutes and two seconds. I'm trying to figure out why. Oh, why. Oh, why, oh, why, oh, why. Are they in a flag match? And how's the flag match for coming to no contest? All you gotta do is pick up the flag. I don't know. I'm confused. It's another one to check out on the network. 29. 99. The sixth match was Sabu with Bill Alfonso defeating the Sandman in a tables and ladders match. 20 minutes and 55 seconds. And then in your main event for November 2, remember, it was for the ECW World Heavyweight Championship. It lasted 25 minutes and 2 seconds. As Shane Douglas with Francine defeated the champion, Bam, Bam, Bigelow in 25. Oh, two. So back to back years, I mean back to back shows, Shane walked out as a champion. Very good. So, well, that is it for the ECW 
year of 1997. Up next, we got part three. Let's talk about that. We got your thumbs up, your thumbs down. And we've got a couple of countdowns for you. And we got one countdown. One countdown. I saw a bunch of numbers. Oh, yeah. And we're going to do the NWA, TNA, and a little bit of X Division tournament. Tournament. Because TNA, NWA does have enough champions to do 32. So I had to throw in five X Division champions. So the top five X Division champions, if you're not a TNA or NWA World Heavyweight Champion at this time, you are in to the tournament. As we'll go over the, we'll go over the 32 names. And that is it for part three. Yes. Coming up next, and let's talk about that. Well, that's it for part two. Pay-per-view review. ECW 1997. Next year. Next year. Next week. Next week will be ECW 1998. There you go. So come on back right here, top of the road, Mike Hogan. And I'm just a car. We'll see you in a few click, 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 clicks on this big Extreme Rules weekend. Hey, ladies.